There she is. Here we are. <laughs> in Gora Gora Crater. A beautiful view behind us. Too. A beautiful view behind us. Look yeah. at that. That's a million dollar view if ever there was one. Or at least a six thousand dollar view. Or at least a six thousand dollar view. <laughs> Let's not talk money now. We'll no. get depressed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Stay tuned for the next one. So here I am. Uh, we just checked into the Serena Lodge and the uh, on the rim of the Angora Grove Crater in Tanzania. And this is the entranceway. Here is the uh, changing area. I guess you could describe it as. See our bags are here. Place for lots of bags down here. Nice tile floor. Big closet to hold things and your safe drawers. Sure what that is down there. Could be a shoe rack. I'm not honestly positive what those two poles are for. Let's call it a shoe rack. Doors are all beautiful mahogany. Uh, bathroom here, really nice bathroom. Uh, two sinks. So it's, that's always nice when you're traveling with uh, with a partner that you have space for both to get ready. Saves um, having to line up to get the use of the bathroom. Everything's really nice and modern facilities here. Really, really nice. Uh, they've got these beautiful uh, kind of cave paintings on the wall, which adds to the ambiance. Some nice, uh, nice white robes are included and a walk-in, a big walk-in shower, which is kind of a, a standard thing here in, the, in Tanzania. Usually they have a rain shower head, this one doesn't. I guess we can live without it for one night. But it's very nice, all tiled, beautifully rendered. Okay, so let's get out of the bathroom. Okay, so continuing here, as I had mentioned, there's uh, these really neat drawings on the wall here. I've never seen anything like this. It's very cool. Very cool. And here's our room. First, I'm going to give you the room. More fantastic paintings. Beautiful uh, vaulted ceiling. Really nice. Uh, beautiful beds. I don't know, we've got a lot of beds in here for two people. Hey, I guess I can have my own bed. Maybe I'll have the little baby one over the corner. So you have a single bed and a king size bed. Very nice. Kind of funky looking lamps. A chair. We already put our stuff on there, so please excuse that. And I bet you that's, is that the radiator? Yeah, that's the heating radiator there. I'm not going to lie. The place isn't new. But it is, it's uh Really nice. But let's face it, there's only one reason you come to the Ngorogoro Crater. <clears throat> this is the view. And that is the world famous UNESCO World Heritage Site, the Ngorogoro Crater. And I've, I have been here before, and um, but I was here in September. We're now here in December, and I can't help but notice that there's a lot more lake in the middle of the crater than there was when I was here uh, last time. So uh, it is, uh, they call it the small rain season. So they have had some rain here today. We will get up and head down and begin our exploration of the Ngorgo crater promises to be an unforgettable morning. So the lodge itself, I'll give you a little shot here, on the outside, check this out, it's covered in stones. It is the funkiest, coolest building ever. Anyone who hasn't been here, which is most people, will be stunned by the flora and fauna here. I said to my wife, I feel like I'm in Jurassic Park. That's what it's like. But you'll notice with the, um, the crater as you go down the vegetation changes and by the time you're at the bottom it's like you're in the Serengeti again with rolling green fields. So we're right on the crater rim at the top of the crater rim uh, which where a lot of hotels are located so the view is spectacular. 
Absolutely spectacular. Here comes Daniel. This is the main dining area, the buffet. The great staff. Okay, bye. Have yeah. <laughs> a safari. Yeah, thank you. Bye bye. Where are you going today, Serengeti? Or? Uh, no, in Gorgora and then Lake Manyara. Lake Manyara. Yeah. Yeah. Not too far from Not here. Not too far from here, no. It should be really good. Here we are shooting down here. Good morning. Nice. Hi. Yes, very good. Yes. yes. Okay, welcome. Thank you. Yeah, so this Hello. is the bar on the lower level. I'm going to walk up to the window and see if it suddenly goes, no, that's what it does. There we go. That is the amazing view that you wake up to in the morning with all of these windows in the back of the lodge. We're perched right on the edge of the rim. Look at that. And to really see it, you have to come here. It doesn't do it justice unless you actually see it with your own eyes. So there's a challenge for you. Make the journey. So this is the bar. Didn't shoot things last night because there's so many people. So do it on the way out in the morning. It was the uh, resort is actually quite full, but um, it gets noisy and some people don't want to be filmed. So I don't want to bother them. So really nice space, needless to say. I think Girl Girl Lodge here. This Serena and Girl Girl Lodge. Serena is a chain that has many lodges. All of them are beautiful. Uh, very well established chain. I would recommend them. We got first class service here. Like honestly you do in, in all of Africa. So yeah, if you can get that, there you go. This is the view. It's just for all these windows right along the back of everything here. So it's spectacular. Here we go. Just for a second out here, we don't have much time. So the main lodging building is one building and then The rooms are separated by little walkways, so we're all raised up here. However, <laughs> they still lock your doors really soundly at night because you are in the National Park. So you don't know who's going to come through. Uh, this morning we looked out our window and saw a huge uh, water buck sleeping, which is a very large deer, almost the size of an elk. So if there's water buck, there's everything else here. Uh, all the animals are present here in the in Gore Crater. So you can see one side you have the incredible view. Here you have the vegetation because you're right on the side of the hill. So very unique. Most of the lodges here at the Ingargo Crater are mounted on the rim of the crater. So all present the incredible view. And there's Tanya, I think she's lost. No? All right, here we go. You come in at the end of the day and you're so into this. Now there's a place to play cards. So what happens with safaris? You come in and you show up around. Good morning, how are you? Good, look at the shop. Just getting set up. Uh, we got to go on safari. Thank you. Uh, no, not today, no. We're leaving. Masai there setting up his stuff. So here we go up to reception. Here's where we just were. Jumbo. A myriad of things. These beaded things are made by the Maasai. And it's, it's, it's wire inside and then the whole thing is beads. They're pretty unique. And they have the obligatory giraffe water bottle. Oh. There's the lions at the end. And there's a very colorful lion next to it. Obligatory fridge magnets. By 
buy three for 15. Oh no, I really want to get more fridge magnets. These are cool, these bowls. I got a kick out of these. For candies or something, I'm going to drop. You know, hard to find anything unique, unfortunately, when you're traveling. It's neat when you see something that's unique. I have too many hats already. Though it fits, it fits remarkably well. I forgot with a huge head. Thank you for joining the Rusty Traveler today and our tour of the Serena Lodge on the Ngorogoro Crater in Tanzania, Africa. Be kind, subscribe. Thanks for your support. We'll see you on the road.